Thank you for joining us. My name is Lauren. And I'm Carson. And from anime to comics, from fantasy to sci fi, this is Input Unknown. Welcome in to Input Unknown. In this episode, we're going to go back to uh, our fond uh, memories and talk about Darkwing Duck. Yeah, love it. Love the show. So, how should we start it off? Um, let's say, um, let's talk about the villains. No one gives the villains too much. Let's talk there. about what Darkwing Duck is first. You want to go right to that? Right, well, because uh, like if you if you don't know who a Darkwing Duck is. Please watch Darkwing Duck. You, 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 <laughs> you did not have a good childhood. You did not have a good childhood. You need to find a way to watch Darkwing Duck because it is probably one of the best Disney shows they have ever. It is the funniest. It has action, comedy, drama. And if you actually if you watch the new Ducktales, he is mentioned in it. Uh, well, Saint Canard. This is yeah. I haven't watched it. He's I need to watch. He's it. mentioned in his city that he runs, much like Batman has Gotham. Um, he has um, his name Saint Canard, which is awesome. It it's pretty great. I wish I had the shirt right now because <laughs> I have a shirt. I have a shirt where it's like Darkwing Duck, but as Batman. In the Darkwing Duck's better. I mean. <laughs> yeah, we'll talk about that another All right, day. Well, for those of you who don't know, Darkwing Duck, like Batman, he has no powers. Yep. He but he has a lot more fashion sense. Um, uh, he, he wears a zoot suit and incorporated into his costume. That is true. The zoot suit is really sick. And he got the wide brim hat. Yeah, oh, oh I love awesome. the hat. The hat is always. And the unlike Batman, he's not afraid to use a gun. All right, come on. <laughs> what he does? He uses a big gun. <laughs> well, it's it's also like a it's also like a, a gimmick gun. Yeah, it, it shoots. Yes, yeah, so it shoots gas canisters and so you know it shoots um, the grappling hooks. Yeah, but he doesn't shoot bullets. If only. If only. <laughs> you would have a lot Crazy, less huh? villains. <laughs> yeah, but then it wouldn't be a Disney show. Uh, that's true. So he also has a niece. Well, a daughter, he, sorry. He, it's he adopted her. Adopted daughter. daughter. I forgot. It's been a while. It's his ward. His ward named D- Goslin. No, Goslin. I'm drawing blanks. I'm, draw, I'm okay. drawing blanks. Yeah, okay. I'm, I'm mixing up a lot of information. His ward is Goslin, who, who he adopted in the, I guess, the first movie slash first three episodes? First three episodes. Something like that? Yeah, pretty much um, his his Robin. Except she doesn't get a super suit. No, because... But she so badly wants one. <laughs> oh, easily. But um, DW, also known as Darkwing Duck, is an actual responsible child... Uh, parent, shut up. <laughs> I, am, I am drawing blanks today. Yeah. Oh, As he's wow. a spectral child, and unlike Batman or Bruce Wayne, he's not loaded with money. <laughs> no, he's not. He's just some regular old Joe. <laughs> he's he just, just like, like man. Uh, what is it? He lives in like a. He lives in like one of those places, you know, where. Um, what is it? House associations? It's house associations? Not such so, um, What's it called? You know, we have to keep the law in the same length. Oh, yeah, no, like you're, right. you're right. He lives in, right. yeah. he lives in like one of those areas. areas. Yeah. He, he, also has a, he also has a sidekick, not Goslin, but his name is Launchpad. If, again, if you watch um, DuckTales, you know Launchpad. Yeah. He's a mechanic and his sidekick, and he doesn't have a butler either. No butler, <laughs> no, no, no special does, money he things. He has annoying neighbors. I love coming to his house and eating all his food. He has, he's pretty much your average Joe turned superhero. Yeah. They, they never really told what his job was. I, Only in the comics, he actually had a job when he retired. Well, that was when he retired, though. I know, but he always, they never showed where he got his money from. That is true. Not, never in the show. It's always, well, does it need to? It doesn't, but I mean, it, it would have been a, something to see. It would have been interesting to see. Like, I work like, two jobs. Take that, Batman. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you he worked like in the grocery store or something like that. That's even more impressive. Than <laughs> <laughs> I'm a manager here at this, at this really crappy mart. <laughs> I don't think manager. I think supervisor, if anything. Oh, yeah. Okay. Like I said, it would have been very, very impressive. 
But yeah. enough of that. Um, like Batman, he also has a great range of villains. R- Rogue yeah. Gallery. Yeah, Rogue Gallery is awesome. Um, if go- if not goofy though, <laughs> very goofy. Uh, was uh, the biggest one I know is uh, Megavolt. Okay, he would be like. I thought you were gonna go Nega Duck. No, I, that's I more rival. Against. That's more rival. I would say Nega. Not. Okay. I would say Megavolt. Yeah, Megavolt. If you don't know, he is a bull, anthropomorphic bull, who has um, electric powers. Yeah, so he's kind of like Shocker from Marvel. He's pretty much the. He's pretty much the. What would you say he would be comparative to the? Um, to Batman. I would say Arch. I guess the kind of like how Joker is. Kind of Joker, but like I, Arch Nemesis. The the one who's really the Joker is the clown. One. What? What's okay. his name? The clown. Oh, um, Cracker Jack. Cracker Jack. Yeah. yeah. They make fun of Joker. They have another person who is. He is a duck. He's a jester. Character also. His name is Cracker Jack, and he main thing he fights with are you know, dentures that the moving dentures that come and attack people. And he has a little cane that has a, like a little head of him. <laughs> he's a hammer. Yeah. yeah, he does a bunch of the gimmicks. So you know that funny gimmicks from like what the Joker would do. Or yeah, he also um, I think the villains that Darkwing Duck has also takes away from um, from Spider Man as well. Uh, with the aqua duck or dog, uh, uh, um, what's the Hyd- hydronator? Hydro the hydronator? Is it? Yeah, it was like hydro hydronator. Yeah, hydronator. I think it was. It was something like that, where it's a dog. It's a dog salesman. It's something like that. I can't remember his origins. Uh, yeah, something like he was selling something. He got water was that a salesman or he was a uh, game show host? Something like that. Something like that. But he became water pretty much. And I, I don't know it was hydrogenator. I'm sure it was hydrogenator, but he got water power, so he's a water dog. Yeah. Um, then there is the poison ivy version of oh, um, bushroot. 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 Bush yep. Bushroot. It was another duck or bird. Duck. Yeah. Whatever. It was another duck. He's pretty much play off poison ivy, but the guy and plays those plants. Yeah. He's a plant person. Nega Duck is just your average. Oh, it's the the bad version of the superhero. Yeah, they're pretty much just a carbon or copy of them. Exact yeah. copy, just evil. Yeah, with with the matching um, opposite colors as well. His colors do look pretty cool, though. It is. It is. It's black and yellow. And the movie was awesome. Where they, um, I I don't remember the movie that much, oh, honestly. Well, um, there's a movie, oh, there's a bunch of movies, but Dark and Duck also has, along with the villains, he also has a bunch of heroes. Um, allies? <laughs> <laughs> Question mark? Why do you say it that way? He has to fight each one before they, like, they're willing to help him in, like, in the mm, epic movie. I guess. He's got, you got the big dinosaur guy, um, Stegmut. Tells you how smart he is. Um, they stupid, but um, yeah, Sam, he has a, I can't, I can never remember what the fish girl's called. I don't remember. I can't remember her name. I know what you're talking about, though. She's like she's the aqua. A real tool. <laughs> <laughs> she's a real tool. Oh, uh, yeah, she's pretty much aqua, aqua man or aqua woman. Aqua, yeah, aqua uh, Mara. Mara. She's pretty much Mara. Um, what was it? What was it the other ones? Um, oh, there's the the witch. The witch, um, I don't Morgana? Know. No, Morgana's the villain. One. Morgana Le Fay? Le Quack? The one. Yeah, that same one. No, I thought she was a villain still. She, no, he fought her as a villain, but then she, she likes him. She's I, crushing him. I thought it was... No, it's different. It's a different name. I can't remember her name. Anyway, anyway, she's magical. She's pretty much like the Doctor Strange. She slash. shows how much we know of the heroes. <laughs> we know the villains. We just don't know the heroes. Uh, what was it? Is that that? Oh, and then the best one. Um, um, the Gadget Duck. The gadget, um, I can't. Gadget? Gizmo Duck. Gizmo Duck. Gizmo Duck. Yeah. Gizmo Duck was awesome. Because he was also in um, DuckTales. He was, and it was, it was awesome. Yeah. Gizmo I Duck. In, I don't know if he's in the new one. Yeah, he's in the new one. Is he in the new one? He's oh, in the new one. I think I, I saw Gizmo him. Duck's in the new one. I've yeah. seen that one at least. I've, okay. seen, I've seen that Gizmo Duck is in there. So he was in that. Um, um, yeah, the Darkwing Duck was a great show. It went over a bunch of different subjects. Such as you know um, pollution, 
went over, you know, if you're mean, you know, be adoption. nice. Adoption. Yeah, adoption. Went over some serious things, too. Yeah, went over. Um, being old and accepting it. So, but um, we were, as we were talking about, we mentioned uh, DuckTales that had a reboot, right? Yeah. So we were thinking, what would it be like if we had a Darkwing Duck reboot? Oh, uh, they don't need it, though. I don't know, because after watching some episodes of the DuckTales one, I could I could see them doing it. I could totally see it. It would be more more actiony. They'd have to, they'd more have to do a whole lot to not to mess it up and to impress me. I think they would. I think they could do it. They made uh, Morgan look Fay, Morgan look Quack or whatever her name. Are you talking is. about dis, um, the spell or dispel? The spell, yeah. Yeah, that's the bad guy. That's what I was talking about. Oh, I was like, well, her name is Morgan. Is it? Yeah. Oh. That's why I was so confused when you were saying that. Like but I think it would be... Um, I think they could totally do it. Uh, I'd have to see it. I'd have to see where that. They don't need it. I'd free... I'd, I'd well, gladly who'd, watch. Who would you want to see as the main villain that shows up, at least in the first season, if we had a... Um, it'd be... It'd be... Um, Vol- be Megavolt? Yeah, it'd be Megavolt. You sure? It, that's when they redid the comics. It was Megavolt again. Or, okay, here. Actually, Taurus Bulma, another villain, he's a bull, obviously, who was in the first three episodes. Him coming back, they read it with him. That could be promising. Yeah. I, I, I'm just saying, like, an overarching villain. Oh, yeah. Because we can, we can have Megavolt show up as a villain. Also, but then he's, if you remember, serious in the thing, it was the first three episodes, they also talk about death. Yeah. Because of, death. wasn't it Goslin's parents? Grandma. Oh, was it the grandma? Grandma or grandpa, yeah, I think it was um one of her grandparents was a scientist and they talked about how they died. Yeah, it was rough. But um I loved I loved the future episode where it was like this is what happens in a world where Darkwing Duck is ex- retired and he just lives out his life and he's like, Man, I kinda wish I was still an adventurer and then it was it was a pretty good episode because it also showed Megavolt as a retired supervillain. That was the comics. No, they showed it in the episode. Oh. Yeah. It was pretty good. I thought it was a great episode. Yeah. But um I would I I'm all for watching a a, a remake, new or remake. Reboot. A reboot of Darkwing Duck. Uh I'd have to see it. I'd have to see it. Who knows? But I think that's gonna be it for this episode. Thank you very much for watching this episode of Input Unknown. And um, if you would like to watch more episodes, please subscribe. Or if you have any ideas for future episodes, just leave a comment below. And we will see you in the next episode. See you later.